The task varies since we are at nighttime and it's corridor wide and we do inspections. It could be anything from um, density testing off site to being out in the roadway looking at MOT and maintaining traffic. Probably traffic would be the largest concern. Um, the other one when you get off of the right of way, uh, you know, it gets to be a little bit darker, you still have equipment moving and um, you know, the potential chance of winding up um, in the wrong spot or not being visible is a concern. You know, in traffic, when I'm out in the roadway, I notice that the motoring public gives us a better response. Um, they slow down, they pay attention more, you know, it definitely stands out. We don't blend in with the cones and the barrels and everything else that's orange and, and shiny out there. What I think they're responding to is, is the halo light, and um, I feel much safer wearing it. Yeah, there's, there's definitely trip hazards in the job that people need to be aware of, and um, you know, in the past, we've we've used aftermarket, you know, headlamps or whatever, and it, um, the batteries don't last very long. Um, they're usually flimsy; they don't stay mounted, and it just seems to be really cumbersome. Since I've been using the Halo, I mean, it just greatly improves my visibility on site, makes it easier to work with hand tools. I can use them for plan reading, taking notes. Um, you know, so there are other benefits outside of just safety when it comes to using the Halo light. I, I definitely feel that the team safety is approved, you know, from the use of the halo. Um, you know, it, it allows us to be visible in areas that we wouldn't normally be. My chances of avoiding close calls has greatly improved since use of the halo um, to a point that I'm no longer comfortable going out in the field without it. So I would definitely give it a 10. The halo light is great. I mean, I couldn't, I couldn't see moving forward without it. So I, I definitely support the product.